guys, so I am back with another video, and today we are going to talk about sexuality, well, specifically my sexuality, and how I have went from being bi curious to being pansexual, and the story behind that is pretty interesting. Um, okay, so in elementary school, I had no clue that sexuality existed, I just thought you were straight, and that was that. And then I heard the word lesbian, and you know the word that curious and bisexual, and I'm like, oh, what's that? So, of course, being the curious nine year old I was, I went on Google search and realized the word lesbian meant girls who like girls. And at the time, I had no clue what the word transgender meant. So, yeah. So, I thought that I was a lesbian because I liked girls and boys were icky. So, yeah. And then middle school happened, and I still liked girls, and I still wasn't interested in boys as much, so I still identified as a lesbian. However, I began to transition into male and then I found myself as a male, so I went from lesbian to straight. At that time, people were like, oh, you can't be straight, a straight male unless you have a penis. And I was like, yeah, again, I can be a male and be straight despite my transition and all that. Yeah. And then high school happened, like end of 8th grade, beginning of 9th grade. I began to identify as pansexual. Because I was dating this boy named Dave for three years off and on. And he was really fun and, and funny and smart. And I liked that. And I'm like, hey, I never dated a guy before, but you seem really chill, so why not? And I was like, well, I can't be straight if I like guys. And then I can't be a lesbian if I'm not a girl. So I was like, I'm not exactly bisexual because I just like people in general. So if you're chill, you're chill, and that's that. So... Yeah, my sexuality is pansexual, but um, at the moment, I'm not in question of it. Just the fact that when I say I'm pansexual, people are like, what is that? And then when I explain it, just like, oh, so bi. It's like, no, I don't fucking get into detail with it. So instead, I just say I like people, I like who I like, and that kind of pretty much covers it, really. So yeah, not really want to get into much detail about what my sexuality is. So yeah, excuse that with my phone. Um... Yeah, that's my sexuality, and yeah, because when I first came out as being bisexual, mom was like, oh, that's great, you know, you could like both, you could be fluid and all that, and then transgender was like, oh, you could be fluid, it's like, I know my sexuality, mom, I'm just telling you my gender, so that's for another video, another time, and yeah, so basically, yeah, and it's funny because now I, now that I identify as male, and I'm more comfortable with my gender and identifying as male who likes semi feminine things, semi masculine things, you know, I'm kind of just fluid with how, you know, my sexuality is. And that's really good because I before I really struggled with what my sexuality was it's like, oh, I like girls but then I also like being known as their boyfriend but then I also like guys and like, I really like that. Like, oh my god, guys. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm just like really, really really fluid with my sexuality. It was just one of the reasons why my friends always say I'm gay. So yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.